Hi, I'm Governor Susan Yap of Tarlac Province. Uh, me, I'm an advocate of um, creating businesses and um, creating entrepreneurs. No, so years back, I've uh, tasked my cooperative and the uh, LAPO officers to look for potential small and um, nano entrepreneurs who have potential to go and export the craftsmanship of uh, Tarlac ingenuity. So um, for Ambiente, which is so timely, no? it coincides with our theme also, Hands That Work. Um, magagaling ang Filipinos in tinkering and um, creativity. Uh, so we've always embarked not only here to uh, introduce our what we have, but also to be known abroad. That's why we actively uh, participated in um, international trade fairs from China, Japan, and now Frankfurt. So in 2020, we joined SITEM and had a booth of our own in Ambiente. Uh, not only mentoring them in the design, but also teaching them the business side of it, from the logistics, um, bookkeeping, everything. No? And uh, we've worked with SITEM and DPI in um, mentoring these uh, in young entrepreneurs. One step up is um, I'm looking for one of the entrepreneurs who joined us then is no longer joining us because <laughs> um, she's made her mark already in the international scene and uh, only does bulk order. So I'm very happy to hear that um, my entrepreneurs have already really uh, is out there na and uh, are already parang uh, matured exporters. Um, but aside from this, we will continue to mentor and we're still searching for young entrepreneurs who have the skills but need the backup um, for training and exposure. Um, we will continue to do this. You know what's happy to share also was during the pandemic, I was asking them, how is your business? Because everything slowed down. From one of the um, several of those that joined the 2020 Ambiente Fair, I was happy to hear that they had orders during the pandemic out of the Ambiente Fair of 2020. One of them started from a, most of them start in their homes with three or five employees only, but now they've put up their own buildings na and are really full grown factories already. It's very hard to get a big investor. You know, um, I've been uh, tapping internationally, inviting investors to invest in Tarlac, but that takes years no, to land a big investor. So I said, be focused on our nano, small and medium enterprises, help them out. And uh, because from, let's say, a factory of just 10 people, now they're hiring already 200. So out of that 10, um, entrepreneurs that we've mentored through the years, if they're already hiring a hundred each, that equivalents, that's equivalent to 2,000 workers. So economically, it is very wise to um, help and assist our SMEs. They're the backbone of our economy. Um, and uh, secondly, it's um, tourism. You know, a lot of people, Balik Bayans and other people who come to visit their luck, they're interested to see the factories of these successful entrepreneurs. We will continue um, under my administration to tap more international trade fairs um, para to showcase ang galing ng Tarlac. No? And um, um, it gives them pride eh, and hope na, hey, we have a chance. But of course, since they're just starting, financially it's difficult. So this is where the provincial government comes in. We work together and um, able to finance a bit of the expenses for the trade fairs locally and abroad. On food, no? Tarlac is an agricultural um, province. Um, I'm working with a lot of other countries also to um, further improve our agriculture. Uh, for example, with Israel government, um, we've sent more than 3,000 of our students to do their OJT an internship in Israel through the years. I also work closely with Japan for export of our vegetables. We do export okra to Japan, one of the biggest. I think we do about 10 million to 15 million kilos annually already. And um, we're expanding to other vegetable products on that front. Uh, aquaculture, 
is uh, one of the things that we're giving focus also on. On lifestyle, um, patuloy yun, no? um, much development and um, investment of the national government is uh, being done here in Interlock with the new park city. So we're doing um, a lot of projects uh, towards that goal.